Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Keep that thing off. I was uh, kind of counting on you to back me up here, buddy. So what the hell's in here? I would think guns and ammo. Well, that's not guns and ammo. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Why is it locked if you don't have kids? Oh, Brenda, Biscuits? you are wow. an angel. Oh, Excuse me, miss. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Mark was just shot in the shoulder unless there's something wrong with the graphics. Why would I... This dairy must have meant a lot to them before the walkers destroyed everything. High school diploma. Okay, I know I'd be wasting time on this. Degree. These boys aren't stupid. Hey, Danny is. baseball trophy. Mm. Seems like it's been years since kids were playing sports for fun. This must be Terry. The hell? Walkers aren't getting through that thing. What the hell is the wire for? Do we want to go to the bathroom? I don't want to go to the bathroom. Ah, oh, the old pull chain. How cool. Why? Ghost pads. Oh shoot, I didn't want to do that. Now I gotta open the damn thing back up. Some kind of lotion. I could use a shave. Ah, Wilson it out, you'll be alright. Why is there a red wire here? Why am I... Oh, I know why I'm sneaking up the stairs. Hell, I'm, I'm urban. I could just say I got lost. They'd figure I was stealing the silverware anyway. Walk towards the edge next to the wall. I guess that was its way of telling me I had control again. Or maybe I did. Hell, I don't know. Books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. Is that blood? Do they need 
so much morphine for? Candles. Smart. Musty as hell. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tube, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Huh, where is that cord going? Obviously a room. I was trying to find a way to move this out, but I guess it doesn't move. So I guess I'll get Urban here and uh, I got a new... Uh, oh... Well, if Mark was in here, why is... He had like an arrow in his shoulder. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Mark. What the hell happened? Uh, brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat dinner. <laughs> Ah, barbecue. Hurry, 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 hurry. Damn it, go, go, go. Don't eat that! What? Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. It didn't have to be this way. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off! You're eating him! That's crazy. What the hell? Damn. You're scaring the kids, Lee. <laughs> Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. I have another Mom, bite. I was eating that. What is going on? They're picking us off to trade us meat. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. Brenda, tell me he's not being eaten right now. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. <laughs> I wasn't implying it, bitch. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like Thank with a hang <laughs> hangnail. Clementine, run! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? Fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking out of go here! Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't wanna die! Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone! Everything will be okay! Lee! Lee! Let go of her, you son of a bitch!
Keep us in here! <coughs> Open up! I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bare hand! You gotta find another way out of here! <coughs> you shit fucking bastards! <coughs> Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the Please, goddamn Dad, door stop. down! It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They... they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm-mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walkers! Dad, please! A lot of meat on old Larry. Please I settle down! I oh, say we give him up. And, and make you swallow them! Uh. Come on! Show yourself, fucking coward! Dad! There's more of us on the way! Let us out now, if you want to live! That is not gonna help! I uh, no, I think Clemmy's You're the only one with a brain. The door. You, Don't you give up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Right Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Dad, this isn't helping! Hey, bread bastards! I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, 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 Easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size! It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up! Wake up! Lee! Is he breathing at all? No! No, I don't think so! Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Yeah. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! You're putting all of us at risk, you son of a bitch! You're fucking worthless, Lee. It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. Oh, well. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! <laughs> Are you okay? Uh, probably not. Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. And and the yelling seems to have stopped. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? It's quieter. 
getting out of here. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. <laughs> now, I would have gladly killed him stand up, but I don't know. And whether he weighs 300 pounds or not, with God, I don't even know what those damn things weigh. They weigh, they weigh more as much as a cinder block or more. But you could take him out at the knees and smash his skull. That's what Lily would be in your way, but <laughs> she might have an accident. That'd be the only thing. God, I, I don't know. I know it was necessary, but I just wish Clem didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. Uh, he is gone. Uh, I don't want to talk to Kenny. <laughs> it's like an asshole convention in this. Oh, Lordy, I guess you can't pick your family and you can't pick the people you sur try to survive a zombie apocalypse with. Uh, I want one damn person I could talk to. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. Yeah, you didn't mind me having the balls the other time, so back off, dude. No, I'm not going to ask him if he could kill cat or duck. I know he could. Uh... Look, if we're going to survive this shit, we got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. Okay. Was that it? What now? What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is their safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. And, and wipe that shit off your face. Oh, oh, can we talk to Larry? Oh, I wanted to talk to him. <laughs> hey, I'm glad he's dead, but I... I don't know, it's hard, I, if I knew beyond doubt, I'm sorry, Lily, if I was alone, I could, I he probably would have been a dead man, Well, Lily, that festered boils off your he was ass still now. Still alive, Lee. He was still alive. I'm sorry, Lily. I truly am. Larry and me, we might not have got along so great, but I know he would have done anything to protect you. He was a good father. <laughs> and wipe that shit off your face too. Look like a bunch of damn zombies. Okay, so why am I? Oh, is that is that my only option here? Should I should have talked to the air conditioner and tried to fix the people? There ought to be an air duct behind this unit, maybe well, big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws, the multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. You know, I bet old Larry had some fillings. <laughs> I know he's got bones in him. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. Trying to, sorry, I was trying to think which bone would be the best one. It's not coming off that way. I don't know what flat bone. I think a jawbone would give you something to work with if you rubbed it off against something. 
Oh, that's just another screw, isn't it? Yeah. It's not coming off that way. Actually, those that sign panel on the door would work. Okay, so we need a coin. Now you know who's got to have the damn coin. I'm oh. sorry, Lily. Oh, I didn't realize I clicked. Okay, Kenny, you got a coin. Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Yeah, never mind. Follow the story. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. You couldn't be barbecue. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. You know, you gotta figure they'd normally be keeping you for sex, but <clears throat> I'm sure the heifer takes care of that, so. You gotta figure you're gonna be walking around on stumps. Oh boy. Um, any idea which pocket he keeps <laughs> <is> changing? <laughs> Come on, just look. Oh, oh that's way too close to the. Uh. You know it's going to be in the one next to his... A ring. My mother's. Don't worry. I'm not taking it. I was going to use it to get all urban and, and buy me a... Uh, pimp my ride. Here we go. <sighs> Two quarters. And a dime. I got a multi-tool. screws and get this unit off. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. <laughs> There's another quarter, asshole. You can come over here and use it. Uh, unless you're not urban enough. <clears throat> Stick your head up your butt and jump and disappear and we won't be bothered with There's you. There's our way out, Lee. We don't know where it leads. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. I, I can find out. Well, somebody's got balls. You think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> Shut okay. up, Kenny. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. 